So then top we go back with another video. I'm Strange Wayne Key is Nate. Today on Copper Drop, we're looking at the film Angel Heart, where we look at a still book coming out, say whether we go cop it, drop it, or like about it, go through our buying process, if you will. But he'll tell you about social media so we can dive into this thing. Social media is in the description box below. Scroll down, pop it open, give us a follow on those. We also have links to our coffee account and our Patreon account. So if you feel it in your heart to support our channel financially, you can click on those. Got some good bonus stuff for cheap in the Patreon. Check that out. We also have the thanks button right down there on YouTube. You can donate to us through that as well. And if you're not going to do any of those things, then subscribe and like the video because those are both free and you still get to help us out. So on the slip, you got fire because of hell. Makes sense. And in the fire, you got words. Makes sense if you've seen the movie. And then on the front of the still book, you have Randy the Ram. If you're a fan of the wrestler, you got homeboy sitting there. He's chilling at a bar. You got this like art picking in black and white. It's cool. It makes sense for the film. Yeah, it is really artistic. I like it a lot. Uh... I appreciate the style of it a lot, especially, and it is kind of cool that the fire and the words come off with the slipcase. On the inside, you got Robert De Niro. He plays the devil in this movie, if you're unaware. He's uh, peeling a hardboard egg. He's got long fingernails, sort of like this one, but they're all long. And uh, that's kind of his gimmick. He's like, the devil likes hardboard eggs. And it makes sense. It's also... Oh, that's a scene from the movie. But the disc gonna cover him up. But the disc got something on him. You got the devil on one, and you got homie on the other. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. I love this movie, and it will be a cop strange wing because you get to see Lisa Bonet naked, and Lisa Bonet is one of the most beautiful women <laughs> ever, if not the most beautiful, in my opinion, of course. So just for that, it's gonna be a cop. But it is a really good movie. I enjoy this movie quite a lot. I hate boiled eggs. I think they're disgusting. They are disgusting. I don't like the texture. I don't like the texture of the whites. I don't like the texture of the yolk when it is cooked that way. So it makes sense that they're the devil's favorite food. So screw that guy and screwed boiled eggs. Oh shit, I just got it. You know what Deviled I Deviled mean? eggs. Right. Stupid. But you know Damn, what, I'm you, stupid. You know what the worst boiled egg is? The ones that they sell in those weird little packets at gas stations. I can't believe people buy those and eat those. That is disgusting to me, and I don't understand it. Not because of that, but just because I've never seen this movie, and I don't have any necessarily like major thoughts or opinions about it because I have not seen it. This will be a drop for me, although it does look like a very nice steel book. That was in Gas Station Pickles. Why? Yeah, and it's like, I understand that it's just sitting in pickle brine. It tastes just like a pickle. Like, I understand that if you unpackaged those and put them on a plate and I ate them, I would probably not be able to tell that they were a gas station pickle. But there's something about that packaging that is absolutely disgusting to me. It's very interesting. Now, and the sausages that come in those bags. Like, yeah. I don't, it's gross. Like, that has such a bad connotation with gas station food that now we're getting nice gas stations, like QTs and Bucky's and things like that, super gas stations. Mm -hmm. And I still would not eat their food. Because of, like, uh, I like 7-Eleven, I'll go to 7-Eleven, I don't want those hot dogs, I don't want that pizza. And then you go to a step up to, like, a QT, and he got, like, shorthand cooks in there. Yeah. It's a fast food restaurant, basically. But I'm I still, I'm not going to eat there because of the connotation of gas station restaurant food. Uh, I will eat at places like that. But this weird prepackaged shit is for the birds. Yeah. Or the devil, in this case. Tell us your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. Scroll up, hit the like button, share the video. It's not a game, it's a red stick.